The first sentiment of man was that of his existence. They lived free, healthy, honest, and happy. The fruits of the earth belong equally to us all, and the earth itself to nobody. But from the moment it appeared an advantage for one man to possess the quantity of provisions requisite for two, all equality vanished. Labor became necessary, and boundless forests became smiling fields, which it was found necessary to water with human sweat. Property started up. Slavery and misery were soon seen to grow with the fruits of the earth. The rich saw that what they had acquired by mere force, others could gain again by mere force, without leaving them the least room to complain of such a proceeding. He invented specious arguments, let us form rules of justice and peace, to secure the weak from oppression, restrain the ambitious, and secure to every man the possession of what belongs to him. Such was the origin of society and of the laws, irretrievably destroyed natural liberty, and for the benefit of a few ambitious individuals subjected the rest of mankind to perpetual labor, servitude, and misery.